Ibor. You won't believe what Mr. Ibu said it will happen to Root Boy of Peace Corps before he passed on. Nobody expected Mr. Ibu last word on ad will be about Root Boy of Peace Corps. I want you to watch the video and see what Mr. Ibu say about Root Boy. But before I play you the full video, I want you to see what this pastor wrote about Mr. Ibu after he died and tell me whether the pastor makes sense or not because people like that the freeze are attacking him for the post that he made on facebook he wrote the man on left is a pastor and he is celebrating his 82 years birthday today the brother on the on the right which is mr ibu is a comedian and he just died at 62 what do you learn from this he used his life to serve serve god that is enok adejire adeboy the redeemed christian church of god general of Asia, used his life to serve god and that is why he celebrated his 82 years birthday when well, Mr. Ibu died untimely at the age of 62 because he refused to serve God. The likes of Daddy Freeze are angry and they have attacked the man on social media. Here is Daddy Freeze's reaction. And yet, Adeboy, 42 years old son, was also a pastor who, by 20 years younger than Mr. Ibu, let be using our sense before creating unhinged narrative. Guys, the truth of the matter here is that only God knows who is serving him sincerely and genuinely. Mr. Ibu death should not cause a religious basketballs in Nigeria. I pray that Mr. Ibu will make heaven and rest with the Lord. Nevertheless, here is the video of what Mr. Ibu said it will happen to Root Boy of Peace Square before he died in the hospital. Root Boy. Oh God. I don't know where to start my language. But everything happens exactly on God's own time. When the time comes, it has come. Good boy, if you not go to heaven, call me Nama. You will go to heaven and will sit down in the presence of the angels who eat together. And with the angel make them a while. The life will never change. What we will be talking about today is how come. How come? and uh, be square. They are not the same parents. I tell you. Many people, after watching the video, they hit praise on Root Boy of Peace Square for clearing Mr. Ibu medical bills without letting Nigerians know. These are millions of bills that Root Boy of Peace Square clear for Mr. Ibu, and he did not film or you know post it on social media for validation. And then be it is other musicians like the video, they will film me and they will post it on social media for people to see and know that they have helped Mr. Ibu. Anyway, God bless Root Boy of Peace Square for helping Mr. Ibu, even though he has now pass on however very dark man believe that what killed mr ibu is different from what every other person has been thinking of and i want you to watch his own video and tell me whether he's making sense or not in this video um all i can say is a lot of things may have said online about the whole issue now let me know what i don't see now let me know what i don't hear so i'm not gonna come out and start talking now we don't you don't buy to me it already buy since you understand based on what i saw to me it already buy it already buy before it already buy since so it was just um managing um yeah. all of us will buy at the end of the day mr ibu went through a lot for the short period that i went to that hospital i'll tell you for free went through a lot the family were not really supportive that one i know for a fact they were not supportive at all crying out loud when i leave person for hospital they go drag money for outside <laughs> this life the best thing that you can ever happen to you is to have a good family around you and leave family and leave person and look at that go they drag money hey they arrest this one they arrest that one they arrest that one you understand not pointing accusing finger on anybody but i will say that the man had a very terrible family it's emotional to be very honest i'm emotional because um the guy is a legend but then again <laughs> They're all gonna buy at the end of the day. So rest in peace to Mr. Ibu. Um a lot of us that genuinely love you. And then uh, whatever thing that happened to you, by the grace of God, um the people everybody that made your life a living hell would actually ah, 
You know what? Just um, rest in peace. Rest in peace, Mr. Igbo.